while NASA may have a comprehensive archive of space exploration history, actually finding something in it is not a task for the weak of heart. It's a massive archive. Uh, they have 500,000 hours of film, um, and they don't even have it indexed properly. So if you say, look, I want a piece of film of Neil Armstrong training in an F-105 or something, they, they kind of go, yeah, right, you know. It's probably in there, but they don't know where it is. And so one of our little things is that we went and we digitized that index. Initially, they treated us pretty much like, I, I would imagine they treat most people who come to them for information. And they thought, oh, yeah, okay, fine, you know, what do you need? Once they started to see that we were doing, that we were serious and that it was a real series and the astronauts were helping us, the astronauts loved the material uh, and that the stuff was actually in the stores selling, then they couldn't do enough for us. Guys like Rob have now become an incredible resource for our return to the moon because NASA has been able to go to them and say, you know, we hear a rumor somebody had an idea way back when, and Rob would say, uh, well, yes, exactly, that, uh, that, that would have been Nova, and, and that happened right here, and we've, of course, got the blueprints for that. Are you interested? We want to make sure that what we present to the public is absolutely the best material we can give them. It's truthful. Uh, uh, it's been well-researched, and we're trying to do it in such a way now with the discs, uh, the DVDs, that are um, really, really cool for the younger generation. I've been astounded by the fact that they have been willing to part with the original rolls of film to let me digitize them. And some of those rolls of film have shown up and they haven't been opened in 30 years. They're sealed, they're vacuum sealed. You're holding that kind of thing and you're realizing this is probably the only copy in the world of this roll of film, and you, you handle that with the respect it deserves. Mm -hmm.